I'm here at the UN Climate Change Conference in Bonn, Germany, and even though I'm not inside the conference, there's a lot that I can tell you going on on the outside. This conference is about perks and partying. For example, there's swag. They're actually giving swag away to the 25,000 UN delegates that have descended on the city of Bonn. We've seen stainless steel water bottles with the UN logo attached to everybody's backpack or belt. And now, while a water bottle seems like a small gift to give away, we looked them up online. We could find them for 17 and a half euros. So let's say they paid about 10 euros a piece for them. They got a deal, a wholesale deal. That's still 250 thousand euros just on water bottle swag for these delegates. That's $375,000 Canadian. That can build a lot of schools in developing countries. That can buy a lot of mosquito nets to save the developing world from malaria. And all over the conference they're using e-cars. Now they're not little tiny e-cars that you might scrape together your dollars and buy. They are BMW e-cars, expensive e-cars that the average consumer could never afford. And then right behind me you'll see a cruise liner, but this isn't just any cruise liner. This is a floating hotel that the delegates are staying in. But it's not just a hotel for them either. They're going on dinner cruises down the Rhine River. They're saving the world from global warming one dinner cruise at a time. And those bikes that Catherine McKenna keeps bragging about using, well, guess what? They're just another perk for the delegates here. They're free. Well, not really free. Somebody has to pay for them somewhere, but the user doesn't have to pay for them. So of course people are using the bikes. They're laying around all over the place free. But let me tell you about Liz May's moment of honesty. Elizabeth May, Canada's Green Party leader, opened up and finally told the truth about what these UN conferences are really about. Uh, another big feature is preparing for the next COP. Next year will be Warsaw for COP24. Yes, Liz May told the truth there. These things are about keeping the party rolling. They're already planning for next year's party, next year's perks, all at your expense. Now, why would the rest of media tell you about what's going on here? Well, they're not because they're enjoying the perks too. They're walking around with those water bottles. They're using those free bikes, but I'm not. I'm here to tell you the other side of the story, the story you won't get anywhere else. For the Rebel.media, I'm Sheila Gunreed. We're here on the ground in Bonn, Germany at the UN Climate Change Conference doing the job the mainstream media just refuses to do. That's tell you the truth. To see all of our coverage, go to rebelun.com.